Hi Cancer, I hope you guys are doing well. Let's see what's coming through for you guys in the month of June. Let's grow ourselves first, okay? Thank you. For some of you guys, you could have Leo in your chart or you have someone close to you that have Leo because I heard Leo for some reason coming through. Let's see what's coming through for Cancer Sun Moon Rising for this reading. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Messages for Cancer for this reading. Oh, beautiful. <sighs> Look at all that green, all the abundance that Mother Earth want to provide it for you as well. Good for June. I feel like this is something that you will be able to see and touch, you know. It could be uh, a gift. Someone want to give you a gift. Um, job offers. Um, but I just see that some things come to you. It could be a letter. Good news. Something that coming your way and um, it's going to make you so happy. For some of you guys, it could be... Um, you winning something, you know, I, I, it could be a contest. It could be something that you apply for. It, I'm seeing like an online application. It's going through as well. You get a, this is a, a big yes, um, big confirmation, approval. That's kind of thing that I'm seeing coming through. But yeah, I did, that definitely something good new. It's like, what I'm hearing is like, yeah, I need a little bit of good news. That's kind of thing that I'm seeing. It's it's like, you, you could be going through something um, that difficult or feel heavy or you feel a bit tired or, you know, a bit exhausted. But it's nice to hear this good news is really going to be uplift you. It's going to put you in a really, really much better, like good mood, you know. That's kind of thing that I'm seeing. What's coming through for cancer? Ooh, four cups. I love how like we have um we see another green right green is all about heart chakra right your heart chakra is being activated that's something this you see the can this is a cancer sign too so you show up beautifully in your reading this is a feeling of wanting to be alone for a while you know you could be doing so many things for everyone or you could be carrying a lot of stuff for other people or you helping other people whatever that is spreading your sh yourself too thin this is more of like i need to be alone i need to you know be in a hermit mode or just really sit with yourself sit feel your feelings you know like it's more of like you sit you you are with yourself long enough to hear the wisdom of your body to you know you know the saying where you feel it to heal something you have to feel it that's kind of thing so i feel there's something that you could be too busy to you know having alone time to take care of yourself or to just chill and relax right and um this card is more saying like they whisper to you but now it's more of like your intuition was like screaming and you're like, you need to take some time, even if five minutes a day to sit with yourself because you don't want to burn out. And um, there's something that needs your attention. There's something important in front of you. And for some of you guys, this could be your health, you know, your health, your emotional needs, something to do with your body is calling for you to take care of that part, that area. Your needs, you know, it could be emotion, it could be physical, it could be um, spiritually, it could be financially, right? Whatever that needs that you you haven't prioritized because there's so many things that need your attention. But they're just telling you to like, you can't give them empty form an em empty cup you need to you know be an example to other people by you know take care of your 
solve your well-being so you can be there for other people and share from an overflowing cup that's kind of thing that i'm seeing but yeah it's important to have that time for yourself the next card we have the king of sword mm, there's some conversation that need to be had um this is a more like a different difficult conversation it could be an honest really honest conversation that you need to have with yourself you know first and foremost the relationship with ourselves is the most important relationship right and this also could be a difficult conversation that you need to have with people close to you but whatever that is it it need to be had especially soon i feel like in especially in the month of june there's something that need to be said um you could be overthinking it thinking for it for a while but overthinking it worrying it is not gonna get you anywhere it's you know it doesn't really help you in this situation this is more of like okay i need to embody this king of sword energy if something not working i need to be honest with myself and i need to be honest with with another person whoever it is right this could be a co-worker this could be friends this could be family member whoever this is but i feel like it's you being honest with yourself first and then you're able to have that conversation but it's gonna serve you well and i feel like it's gonna make space for the good fortune for that good news to come to your life it's like when you clear whatever this this is you have a conversation you express your truth authentically you clear the space for the beautiful thing to come into your life. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Pentacles. You know, it's we all learn from one another, right? No one knows everything. And it's not to say like you have to put people on pedestal, but it's, con it's more of like seeing everyone as a teacher and a student. You learn from them, they learn from you. You know, that's kind of thing. And... Uh, you're gonna learn so much about yourself by speaking your truth and they're gonna learn so much from you too and i feel like it's it it's building foundation you know again this could be work this could be relationship this could be romantic relationship this could be you know your loved one but i feel like this is so important to grow yourself to be honest with yourself right you're doing this inner work you're realizing that what is important and knowing that okay i need to you know have this conversation this important conversation and it's only gonna go up from there i definitely see a lot of i do see a strong foundation being built right and when we care about someone we are being honest with them. That's the best thing you can do. Like you are being true to who you are and you being honest with them because you want them to do that to you. And together, because it's built on uh, honesty and compassion, it's, you know, whenever it come your way, you got able to work it out. That's the kind of thing that I'm seeing, you know? Let's see. The message coming for cancer we have the daughter of earth which is page of pentacle you see this is all about learning this is student you learning each other love language it's interesting how sometimes we can get into conflict that, you know we can get into conflict with someone or argument but when you really dare to listen to one another you're realizing that oh we we literally coming from the same place it's just that we grow up differently we have different will about life but it's like at the end of the day if you really care about this and you want this to work you will find a solution and you learn about each other more i feel like you learning each other language you like oh if you do this it means you care about me or i would feel loved and cared for if you do this you know but not making assumption this is like being honest being kind with one another and and knowing that at the end of the day you want this to grow you know we want to grow this together that's beautiful 
Anyway, guys, thank you so much again for your love and support. I will talk to you soon. Love and light. Bye.